Hi, I'm Dr. Nathan Fountain. I'm a professor of neurology at the University of Virginia, where I'm also director of the Comprehensive Epilepsy Program. The most important things you need to know is that when you see your doctor, you'll want to know your doctor or you will want to tell them what kind of spells you're having so they can be sure that they're seizures. And that means they'll want to know specific characteristics about what kind of things you do when you're having a spell or a seizure. They'll want to know how often it occurs, what kind of things bring it on. But they'll also want to know other things, like how you're feeling even in between seizures, or whether or not you think your medications are giving you problems. An important part of the visit will also be the neurological examination, which is just a physical examination that neurologists do, but also checks things that are relevant for the nervous system. You might be familiar with things like tapping on your knees and having you walk. Another important part that might occur after the visit is uh, MRI, which is a way to look at the structure of the brain. It takes pictures of the brain. EEG, or electroencephalography, is a way to measure the brain waves. And it's an important test for people with seizures or epilepsy because it can help identify small changes in the brain waves that might be important in diagnosing your problem. And of course, when you're done with your clinic visit with your doctor, the first time you see him and every time you see him, you should know and you should demand to know whether or not they think they're seizures, what kind of seizures they are, what are the next steps in diagnosis, and what to do about treatment. Please let us know if you have any questions after you read these web pages. Thank you.